So let's make a quilt sandwich. The first thing you do is you take your back. This is your quilt back. You lay it on a flat surface big enough for your quilt and you tape down the back. You want to just get that so that there are no wrinkles anywhere. So you get your tape. Stretch it. You don't stretch it. You just gently flatten it. Take your piece of batting. Make sure these things are big enough for your entire quilt. And you lay the batting. Just lay it smooth. Just make it smooth. And then you lay your top, your quilt top, right there. Look at that. Everything fits. You should always have extra of your back and your batting. And then you start to pin. And you pin this, pin, 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 pin. And you're pinning with safety pins I like to use so that you can take this up off the table and hand stitch as you're watching your favorite TV show or your child or having a community activity with other quilters or other people so that you can take this and walk and use it and sew it as you're going. Even take it to your sewing machine.